Once upon a time, in the bustling city of New York, there lived a brave and curious girl named Isabella. Isabella loved reading and exploring, and she especially loved superheroes. Her favorite superhero of all time was Spider-Man. Isabella would spend hours poring over her Spider-Man comics, imagining herself swinging through the city, fighting crime, and saving the day. One evening, as Isabella was getting ready for bed, she noticed a glowing light coming from under her bed. Curiosity sparked within her, and she knelt down to take a closer look. To her astonishment, she found a small, magical book hidden away. The cover shimmered with Spider-Man's web and the words five-minute Spider-Man stories emblazoned across it. Isabella couldn't believe her luck. She settled into her cozy bed, holding the magical book tightly in her hands. Little did she know that this book had the power to transport her into the world of Spider-Man. As she opened the book, Isabella was instantly whisked away into the bustling streets of New York City. She found herself standing on top of a skyscraper, with the wind blowing through her hair. Looking down, she saw Spider-Man swinging from building to building with his incredible web-slinging abilities. Excitement enough filled Isabella's heart as she realized she had become a part of Spider-Man's world. Spider-Man landed beside her, his red and blue suit shining brightly. He smiled at Isabella and said, Isabella, welcome to the world of superheroes. Are you ready for an amazing adventure? Isabella nodded eagerly, and Spider-Man took her hand. Together, they swung through the city, leaping from rooftop to rooftop. They patrolled the streets, keeping an eye out for any signs of trouble. Isabella couldn't believe her luck as she fought alongside her favorite superhero, using her quick thinking and bravery to help save the day. Throughout the night, Isabella encountered many of Spider-Man's famous villains. Each time, she faced them head-on, using her wits and the lessons she had learned from reading the Spider-Man stories. Whether it was battling the Green Goblin, outsmarting Dr. Octopus, or stopping the evil plans of the Vulture, Isabella never lost her spirit or determination. As the night drew to a close, Isabella and Spider-Man returned to the top of the skyscraper. They watched the sunrise, the city slowly coming to life beneath them. Isabella felt a sense of accomplishment and pride. She had become a true superhero, even if just for one incredible night. Spider-Man turned to Isabella and said, Isabella, you have shown great courage and bravery tonight. You have proven that anyone can be a hero, no matter their age. Remember, with great power comes great responsibility. Never forget the lessons you've learned, and always stand up for what's right. With those words, Isabella felt a warmth fill her heart. She knew that her adventure with Spider-Man had come to an end, but the memories and lessons would stay with her forever. Spider-Man opened the magical book once more, and Isabella found herself back in her cozy bed, clutching the book tightly in her hands. As Isabella drifted off to sleep, she knew that she would always cherish her special Spider-Man adventure. She had learned the value of bravery, friendship, and using her powers for good. Isabella knew that no matter what challenges lay ahead, she would always have the spirit of a hero within her. And as the stars twinkled in the night sky, Isabella's dreams were filled with more adventures, both in her imagination and in the real world. For Isabella, the journey of a hero had just begun, and she couldn't wait to see what the future held. The End